secure for seat. It should move around a little bit. It's going to move around some more. You know, you walk around and you don't see people covered with sweat today for a change. And uh, the boat's moving. It's a little drier. It's going to get even drier than that, and the boat's going to move some more. So let's get out, tie things down, and make sure we're ready for that. Sea's pretty good size, good swells. I think the deck's all the way up to 30 plus feet. I haven't seen pitching decks like this since maybe 1985, 20 years ago in the North Atlantic, and uh, had not seen the deck move quite this much. You know, here we're out doing pitching deck. Do I agree with it or disagree? It's not for me to say. It's probably a little bit beyond where we need to be. Taking up and landing on an aircraft here is, um, from a pilot standpoint, is a, is a perishable skill. We've learned over the years that uh, a certain amount of practice in certain conditions is required to maintain the capability to do that professionally and well. This is absolutely more dangerous than it was actually flying missions in the Gulf. Go get him. We got lucky in the Gulf. The seas are pretty calm. But out here, pitching decks, this is scarier. You still got to come back and land on the boat. <laughs> Your brain, when you come aboard, you kind of start to think that the runway is a fixed object. And that's what you reference things on, where it's not a fixed object and it's actually moving. And it, it'll, it'll kill you in a second. Strap the waist, strap the waist, make a ready deck. Paddles, lenses on, you have control. Three and a half to three, glide slope, targeting three wire. Stand by to recover aircraft. It's simply a different feeling when you know there's no divert available. There's no safety net out and around the aircraft carrier that you can go to if you have some emergency with your airplane. You have to land back on this ship.
I'm not comfortable with the conditions. So we decided to scrub uh, the remaining night events, but we still had aircraft we need to recover in the dark. No matter how long you do this business, you never, you never get used to the nighttime. At night, your visual is not as accurate as it is in the daytime. So you can get vertigo. You know, they always tell people to respect nature. Respect the sea, never turn your back on the ocean. I mean, all the little things that you learn. It's the same thing, you better respect the night. When the ship gets to the side to side rolling, it makes your instruments kind of do funny things in the cockpit. So you're just kind of coming down and you're kind of blinking your eyes, trying to make sure you're on the center line. And after the seventh guy in a row bolted, you know, I wonder how many tankers I can launch and how long this goes before we start getting some people aboard and recovering. 15, 15 bolters or wave off so far. And then all of a sudden I'm like, holy cow, I'm a little high. And next thing you know, So now you're in the bolter wave off pattern and you're looking at all these other airplanes that are in the bolter wave off pattern with you. Holy shit. Seriously, that was the first time I ever really felt like I am about to hit the back of the ship. Uh, I am about to smash into the back of the ship and go into a million pieces. Little power to catch it. Little power to power. So, uh, you know, you're bringing the power off, bringing the power off, and I'm like, that's that's all I'm giving you, man. I, you're, I've never breathed so fast and so hard in my life. It was just unbelievable. I was just, I was, I was shaking. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely one of the most stressful experiences I've ever had. I always get an eerie feeling when I'm the last guy on board. I'll tell you that. One zero two on course five miles. One two. There's no one to save you. There's no gas airborne. You got to do what you, you need to do to to get on deck. Starting the Dutch roll, dude. It's all yeah, yeah, just wait. No, he's <laughs> It's going to continue to get worse. Uh, uh, yeah, he's, I'm telling you, he's going around. He's dude, going he's around. Done. Look at this. He's oh, going oh, around. Oh, he's going oh, around. Oh, Already out of sync. No, no. It's going to settle out. Right there. I'm with these. It's going to settle out. No, it's going to settle out. I don't think so. He's going around. Seven right up off five two. Oh, <laughs> He's going morning. around. Look at I got more black cam. I don't him. know what to do. Oh, screw black black cam. Look at that. Oh, oh steady down. Yatch. Oh, oh, shit. He's going to get aboard. Oh, rock steady. Sit around, paddle. Oh. Sit around. Oh. Sit around. Oh. Oh. Jump the low. That's yeah. right. Jump the low. Jump the low. Jump the low. Good night, all right? You too. Oh, wait. Let's go.